Hi guys. I hope you're all doing well this evening or this morning or this afternoon. It's like I always say, like, good night, y'all, all the time in my videos. And it could be any time of the day. So tonight I'm going to try something different. We'll see if if I can come up with something. But anyway, I'm going to do a Michael Kors collection video. Um, I don't think I've had a request for this, but I don't know. I just been wanting to do it and I thought it would be fun. So we'll get started. So the first um, piece that I have that I'll show you guys, some of you guys have seen before because it was in my um, Louis Vuitton Delightful unboxing video because this is what I've been carrying when I'm not carrying my Delightful and I'm actually carrying it right now, which I love this bag. It's in the luggage color and you'll guys see that I love the luggage color. So it has the gold hardware and the tassel and I absolutely love this bag. The other day my mom handed me my purse in the car and I got all wet and this part was like sitting in a thing of orange juice in the car cup. So it's not too bad. It's all right. But anyway, I love this bag. So if anybody wants me to do a review on this bag, I will. It's very nice. It has a shoulder strap and the crossbody and the gold hardware. So it's very nice. So that's my first piece. This piece I just got the other day and I was going to, I did do kind of an unboxing on it, but I decided not to upload that. But this, if you guys have seen um, my video where I had some things for sale on you on eBay and I did a YouTube video on the items that I had for sale, I had a wristlet that was similar to this, but I realized that I'm not a wristlet girl, that I'm more of a crossbody girl. So I sold the wristlet online and then I got this off eBay and I just received it like earlier this week. But it has a snap closure here, it has the Michael Kors emblem there and it says Michael Kors down there. And this too is in the luggage color. It's crossbody. As you can see, it just has this one long strap. It has a pocket back here, which I love. At first, when I was looking at this bag, I thought, well, maybe it's just too much going on, but then I decided it's probably the best bag for me. It has an open pocket in the front, and then it has a pocket here, and it has credit card slots on this side, open pocket, open, and then another slip pocket. And it does close with snaps here. And I did test these when I first got it, and the snaps work perfectly. This was pre-loved, but you can barely tell it was used. And then it has an open pocket here in the back. So I kind of don't like stuff with like a lot of zippers and open pockets and stuff. But I decided after trying it out a few times at the store that I really did like it. I didn't really want to pay 100 and I think it's $88 for it. But I decided that, that I would. So... Well, not, I didn't decide that I would actually. I uh, got it off eBay and I got it for like 80 bucks or 90 bucks cheaper. So, and like I said, it is pre loved, but it's in wonderful condition. It's great. So, there's my second Michael Kors item. My third is my Michael Kors watch. And this is the runway watch. I should have looked up the, the size of it, but it is the middle size so it's not the small size and it's not the largest size so it's the gold tone it has the michael kors on the back right here and i absolutely love this watch i wear it almost every day so i thought it would be too big for my wrist because my wrists are my wrists are pretty small but i actually really like how it looks so the second thing i have or the next thing is i have this bracelet and it's the luggage tone of course and it's got gold tone hardware and um they can they move around but they just move between this bracket and this bracket here so they don't move very much but yeah i love this it goes really well when i have my purse on so i'll just put all this stuff on so i can show you guys how it looks on which usually I don't wear it on this side of the watch, but I really like how that looks together. And then I have this bracelet, just a bead bracelet. It has a little Michael Kors emblem right here. And it did have this on it, just right here on this end right here. But my grandbaby did yank that off the other day, so I'm gonna have to get that reattached. So, and a lot of you guys have seen this on in other videos. The only thing I don't like about this, it has this leather um, closure type thing, like leather pulls, and you kind of tighten it 
with this right here and it just doesn't seem like it stays tight so I, like throughout the day when I'm wearing it I always have to loosen it up so let's get that focused but you guys can kind of get an idea of how that looks on the last thing I have which I don't wear very often is this Michael Kors bracelet here it just has little Michael Kors on the end and it has this toggle type closure but it's way too I ordered it online and it's just way too big for my wrist but I'll put it on so you guys can see and I think if I took it to a jeweler I probably could get it resized but I don't know I might do that we'll see because I really do like it so here's how it looks so those of you that have bigger wrists it would be very cute very nice piece so the next thing I have is this Michael Kors pencil bag you see it still has the tag on it I've had it since about April or May and I still haven't used it so if I don't use this by December then I probably will sell this on eBay or something because I like the idea of it but I don't carry like that many pens and pencils and things like that like if you're an agenda person or um, in school or something like that then this might be really handy right now I don't, if you guys have seen my other videos I use this Brighton pencil case and I put just a few pins in there and then other things like coupons and things like that in it so but this is really cute and I actually saw BJ Taylor had this and I did see that in her video and I was like I should use it but I just don't use like I got it from Macy's I think it's regular $58 and it was on sale and then I had a coupon so it was an extra 20% off that so I got a good deal on it so I was like oh let me get it but it wasn't that good of a deal because I haven't used it and it's been a while okay so the last couple things I'm going to show you are shoe items so here are some Michael Kors sandals that I have of course in the luggage color because I'm psycho but these are so cute like see that little thing that goes around your ankle it says my MK right there but these they're wedges they're very comfortable because they're they're kind of high but it's like walking on the ground because there's you know there's no real there's not a big difference between the front and the back of the heel so but I love this and it goes really well it looks really cute with jeans and with my purse my second pair of sandals that I have which I these are like my absolute favorites and I wore these like to death this summer but they're kind of like gladiators but not so they have this toe wrap here and they do have this gold tone down here and it says Michael Kors it says Michael Kors like over there I thought this gold might be too much for me because I'm not like fancy like that you know but I absolutely love these and so they go around like this and buckle like that it's just really very cute I wore these all summer so you can see they're kind of getting worn out but I love these okay my next my last Michael Kors piece that I have I just got a couple weeks ago but there's some Michael Kors boots and I've been eyeing these puppies for a while and I got these off piperline.com use some rewards points that I had so has little MK there it says Michael Kors at the bottom has the gold little studs here yeah little studs and it is um like mesh I guess you could say like you can see through this so I guess it wouldn't be that warm in the winter but I do like the bottom because it is going to be good for like if it's slippery outside or ice or something like that but I absolutely love these looking forward to wearing those this winter and that is my last piece in my Michael Kors collection it's not very big but I don't know I just thought it'd be fun to kind of do a collection of the Michael Kors stuff that I do have I will show you one more pair of shoes though that I got to go with my purse and these are Steve Madden's aren't these delicious are they wonderful look at these they're so cute and they're just so cute on like normally I would never 
um, get a heel. And I know you guys are going to say that's not even that high, but for me, it's kind of high. Like, I just don't do heels like that. I would never have bought this by myself, but I was with a friend and she was like, they were so super cute on. Like, they were just they were so cute and she's just like you gotta get them you gotta get them and i was like but i can't walk in them and she's like just get them so i did and they were having a really good sale so i did break down and get them but these are steve mann's but as you can say see they're in like that pebbled leather and pretty much the luggage color so very cute together with my other michael kors accessories so as you guys can see i went michael kors luggage crazy since about March, I think is when I got my watch and then I've just been adding to it ever since. So I probably won't get anything probably till the spring, probably. So we'll see. But I hope you guys enjoyed my Michael Kors collection video. Um, please rate, comment, subscribe. If you have any comments, just leave them down. And y'all take care. <laughs> Bye.